FDA celebrating agriculture, food, and lots of family fun. The Rock Island County Fair is underway this week. And my co-host, Kyle Keel, is spending this afternoon at the fairgrounds in East Moline. He joins us live now. Kyle, it's going to be an exciting weekend. Yeah, it certainly is, Morgan. There's been lots going on this week, and we've got a lot of fun things planned here for today and tomorrow at the Rock Island County Fair. 155th year for the staple here in East Moline, Illinois. And joining me now to talk all about the Rock Island County Fair is Eric Yoder. He is on the fair board. Eric, thanks for joining us. No problem. Thanks for having us. Yeah, you've had a busy week so far, and uh, really this is a place that families come back to year after year. What makes the Rock Island County Fair so special? The thing I think is really unique here is being right in the urban setting and bringing those people to the fair I think is really fun about this place here. All right, you know, we were talking that uh, usually during fair week, I mean, it's just sweating. I think last time I was here, we were talking about record temperatures, but uh, really this weather's been perfect, and uh, you've had a lot of people uh, coming through, and you'll probably have a, a lot more people coming through because you have a couple fun events playing here for tonight and again tomorrow, right? Yep, that's correct. So the weather's been gorgeous. We had some storms to start the week, but uh, now things are really ramping up and people are coming out. Um, tonight we've got our micro wrestling on board for uh, 7 o'clock tonight, so those are $15 to get into the seats here in the grandstand to see the micro wrestling uh, they had their own tv show on the discovery channel and everything okay. so they're uh, kind of renowned and so we're excited to have that tonight yeah. uh, tomorrow's our biggest day of the week we'll have the demo derby to finish off the fair tomorrow night and that's always a record crowd so and the demo derby is something i remember coming to all the time as a kid along with uh, some of the fair rides the zipper was not my favorite but uh, a lot of fair rides as well yep that's true we got the carnival uh, has wristbands tomorrow from noon to four o'clock for kids so thirty dollars you can ride the uh, the uh, tomahawk as many times as you want so uh, that'll be a great thing and uh, a lot of fair food here and then uh, we've got bands playing tonight and tomorrow night as well so that's something new for us this year so we're pretty excited about that all right i want to kind of go back to the micro wrestling so for those who haven't seen the discovery channel show yep. what exactly is micro wrestling yep. so this is a group of uh, people that are maybe a little shorter in nature and uh, they have their own uh, their own group that they wrestle with and uh, i've looked they have shows all across the country going uh -huh. on right now and and uh, i haven't heard if they got another season yet of their tv show uh -huh. but it was really popular so people are coming out with they've already sold out of the bleacher the the downstairs uh, seats for tonight so big crowd's coming so wow sounds like a big hit so let's go back to the fair food yep. uh, there's a couple of new things that people can try out yep. that ha haven't really been at the fair before yep. right yep this year we have a new food stand that has mini donuts and ice cream so you can't beat the combination of those two things <laughs> yeah you certainly can't go wrong for that so uh, people want to come out what's admission price yep so the fair is absolutely free uh, to get in until eight o'clock and then it's five dollars after that so yep just come on out and no charge okay and uh, when does uh, Rock Island County Fair 2025 start when is the planning start for that yep it'll start Sunday so <laughs> as soon as we get done here we'll start thinking about things for next year and looking for new entertainment and uh, new rides and uh, you know food and all sorts of things all right and uh, going back to the it's probably the most popular ride that you have out there this uh, year for, for the kids and the adults. I've been standing around a few kids and they keep talking about this tomahawk thing and it goes way up there and I'm not sure I want to get on it, but uh, that's been the one I've heard a lot about. So <laughs> they are waiting to get on. <laughs> All right, the tomahawk. All right, so there's lots to do here at the Rock Island County Fair. Of course, tonight we've got the micro wrestling at the grandstand and then tomorrow night is the awaited demolition derby. It's a, certainly a popular time for everyone to come out and check, th check things out here at the Rock Island County Fair. And as Eric mentioned, it's wristband day tomorrow, so you can pay $30 and have unlimited rides at the Carnival here at the Rock Island County Fair in East Moline. It's uh, right off of Archer Drive uh, near United Township High School. Always a good time. And uh, coming up in the next half hour of Quad Cities Live, uh, we're going to go down a little bit and maybe check out some baby animals. And in between that, uh, we'll see if Janae, the photographer, and I can find some fried food. So uh, we'll, we'll look forward to that. <laughs> Live in East Moline for Quad Cities Live, I'm Kyle Keel. We'll send it back to you, Morgan. Thank you.